Goa 2024. The present with me for this inaugural session of Invest Goa Summit 2024. Former Union Minister Sri Suresh Prabhuji, Industries Minister Sri Mavid Gurinoji, Goa IDC Chairman Mr. Reginaldo Lorenzo, Chairman of CII Sri R. Dinesh, Chairperson of GCCI Sri Srinivas Rempo, the past Chairman of the CI Western Region and CMD of the Rasta International Limited, C. Piruj Kambata, Director General of the CI, Sri Chandrajit Banerjee, and uh, Deputy Chairperson of CI, WR, and President of the BM Salgaupar and Brother Limited, Ms. Swati Salgaupar. Other luminaries on the stage and the industry fraternity of Goa in the audience, my friends from media and dear friends. First of all, I congratulate Madam Shishi Soni for the Padma Shri Award. It is with the immense pride and joy I welcome you all to the magnificent shore of the Goa for the Invest Goa Summit 2024. We stand at a crucial moment in our state history, the poised to transform the Goa not just as a tourist paradise, but as an example of the economic growth and opportunities. And the heart of this transformation lies in the singular force, ease of doing business. Over the past few years, my government, with unwavering support of Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji and his visionary leadership, has undertaken the series of bold reform to unlock Goa's immense potential. We have cut through the red tape, streamlined the process, and created the fertile ground for your dreams to take root. We are building the future, the world-class highway, port, airports and digital connectivity to keep you seamlessly connected and your business humming. But our commitment doesn't stop there. We believe in the collaboration, not competition. That's why we are fostering a vibrant ecosystem of innovation and entrepreneurship. We are partnering with the leading academic institutions, incubators and accelerators to cultivate the skilled workforce and nurture your ideas. And behind the ease of business, we are offering unparalleled quality of life. Goa is not just the beaches and sunshine, it's a cultural tapestry and a thriving community, a heaven of peace and harmony. It is where your work, work flourishes and your family thrives. To the investors, we extend our open arms and firm handshake. Come to Goa, invest Goa, and grow with Goa. Your success, our success, your journey, it's our journey. We are in the partners with the progress committed to your every step. To the entrepreneurs, the Goa is your canvas, your lands, lands, landscape. Let your creativity soar, your venture take flight. We will fuel your dreams with support, mentorship, and a platform to reach the world. To the world, the look at Goa, not just as a tourist destination, but as an economic powerhouse waiting to be the unleashed. We are ready to be your gateway to India, your bridge to a billion dreams. The Invest Goa Summit is not just an event, it is a promise. A promise of the vibrant future, a shared prosperity, and Goa that shines not just with the beauty, but with the boundless potential. I'm proud to state that, and we have the healthy manufacturing base here in Goa. We are contributing to the maximum percentage of India's pharmaceutical production. We have the companies that preferred suppliers, Boeing, Airbus, and ISRO here in Goa. We have the companies that are the global leaders in FMCG sectors manufacturing here in Goa. Thus, just illustrate that, and while we are the global leaders in tourism, we are not far behind in the industrial space as well. Friends, and when the team of the GIDC, along with the industry's minister, the come up 
with an idea of an endless survey. I readily agreed to it. I am of the firm belief that through the deliberations throughout the day and we can chat out the new course of Goa's economy and economy and we head into Amritka. Through the agenda of the Amrit Bharat and Swayopana Goa, we seek to take ahead the ideas of Make in India and Make in Goa. We understand the importance of the logistic to this world. Hence, we, the government of Goa, has granted the logistic status to the industry, thereby increasing the land availability for the logistic development as well as allowing the sectors to enjoy the various incentives offered by the government. Economic growth can be achieved with the skilled workforce. Hence, the focus of my government has been on skilling, reskilling, and upskilling for the local talented pool. Under the leadership of Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji, India is now fastest growing economy in the world. Goa has benefited considering due to the support of the Government of India and I am sure that the cumulative impact of the Union Government and the State Government that we often call double engine, the impact of everyone to see and believe. So friends, come let us join hands to, real, to realize the dreams of Swayopurna Goa in all sectors, utilize the immense potential that Goa has to offer. Let us create one of the India's most vibrant Indian ecosystem in Goa and let us other drive inspiration. To all the prospective investors, I am appealing, Yayat, go and invest kara. Come, Goa welcomes you. Is Adhadi ke Amrut Kaal mein, aap sabhi ko, mein Maniya Pradhan Mantri Narendra Modi ji ka Vikasit Bharat 2047 ka sapna, jo Modi ji saakar karna chaate hai, और 2014 से लेके आज तक क्लीन इंडिया से फिट इंडिया तक डिजिटल इंडिया मेक इन इंडिया मेक मेक फॉर द वर्ल्ड स्टार्टअप इंडिया स्टैंड अप इंडिया एवरीथिंग इट डीड फॉर द कंट्री और अभी यही समय है सही समय है आओ गोवा में इन्वेस्ट करो मुझे लगता है कि यही समय सही समय आप गोवा में इन्वेस्ट करेंगे और Goa Vikasit Bharat 2047 ke saath saath Vikasit Goa 2047 bhi aap log saakar karenge yahi mein sirf aap logo ko namra vinanti karta hu aur meri vaani ko viram deta hu Jai Hind Jai Bharat Thank you sir